brand new butt. My name is Janice Saffel and I've created a great 30 minute workout that's going to redefine and shape your buns. We're going to help you out. Make sure you have a chair and some dumbbells handy because we're going to use it throughout our class. Are you guys ready? We're going to start with a great warm up to help warm up those legs. Alright, give me a big inhale up and an exhale down. One more, big inhale up. Exhale down, hands on your hips, give me a step touch to the right. That's it. Bend those knees, abs are in tight, your shoulders are back. Give me a little scoop, so you're going to take it down and up. That's it. We're going to warm up those legs a little bit. That's it. Now give me two to the right. Take it back. Excellent job. Come on. Give me some energy. That's it. Two more. Excellent job. You're going to give me a little toe tap with the two. That's it. Good job. Come on. Reach that leg out. Feel that stretch all the way down. Come on. All right. You guys ready for arms? Adding a pump with the arms. Pump it over. That's it. Come on. Put some little attitude into it. That's it. Come on. Push it up. Now hold it here. Tap it out. Hold it here. That's it. Come on. Reach it up. All right. Add both arms. Take it around. Push it down. Excellent job. Come on, relax the shoulders. Just getting that body core temperature a little warmer for, for our work later. Now take those arms across the chest, reach it around. That's it. Should feel really good through those shoulders. Come on. Reach it back up. Come on, all the way up. And take it across. Hold it here. Add a little toe lift up. That's it. Come on. Nice and strong. Excellent job. job. Now give me doubles. Two of them. Two again. That's it. Come on. Take it back for singles. Let's go. Pull it back. That's it. Last time for doubles. Nice job. Give me two more. Come on. Now give me a step touch. Hands are on your hips. That's it. Lunge it out side to side. Hold it here. Watch your knee alignment. Your knees are right in line with your heels. Good job. Hold it in the middle. Take a big inhale up. Exhale down. Turn it to the right. Lift up on that foot and place it down. Your hips are forward. Toes are facing forward. Abs are in tight. Add a lift. Reach it up. Biceps. That's it. Reach it up. Biceps. Pull it in. That's it. Come on up. All right. With the bicep, you're going to add a little toe lift. All right? Squeeze those buns and reach. That's it. Warm it up for that exercise to come. That's it. Come on. Take it up. Give me one more. Reach it up. Now hold it down on that toe. Tuck your hips forward. Drop it down. Feel the stretch all the way down that hip flexor. Pull that back leg in and sit it back. Stretch out that hamstring all the way down. Slight bend in the knee. Place the foot down. Tuck the hips under for two. And release it. Again. Tuck it under. Now roll it all the way up. Head comes up last. Face front. Take a big inhale up. Exhale down. Turn it to the left. The same thing. Hips are forward. Abs are in tight. Add a lift. Reach it up. Now biceps. Pull it in. That's it. Come on. Reach. Pull it in. Excellent job. Take it up. All right. Ready for that lift with the foot. Take it up. Now lift. Up and down. That's it. Up. How's that feel?
these buns today. All right, you need a chair or a step top, or if you're really advanced, you can try these exercises without any balance. We're gonna start with a four count squat. Make sure your knees are facing forward and your shoulders are back. All right, abs are nice and tight. Are we ready? Squat it out, let's sit. Down, and up, and in. That's it. Abs are in tight, come on. <laughs> and down, and up. Last one. That's it. All right, let's take it to tempo. Ready, go. Down, and up. Come on, sit back in that imaginary chair. Down, and squeeze. You're breathing. Abdominals are nice and tight to help protect your back. That's it. Squeeze. We're going to add a little outer thigh lift. Take it down, and up. Lift, and in. Down, and up. Lift, and in. Now make sure your knees are facing forward as you lift that leg up. So you really get that outer thigh, get the upper hip. Come on, take it down, and up. <laughs> One more. Down, and lift. Now hold it here, bring the feet together. Slight bend, tuck your hips forward. You're gonna give me a little buttock squeeze to the back. Relax the shoulders, and go. Take it back. That's it. Make sure your toes are facing forward. You're standing up really tall. You're not leaning too heavily into your chair. Come on, squeeze it back. Now you're gonna give me a little hip rotation. The heels come together and you rotate back. Just make sure those hips remain facing forward. That's it. Good job, yes, this is excellent. Come on, and squeeze. Make that muscle do the work. That's it, we're gonna put both of those together, all right? Give me one straight back, now rotate back. That's it, squeeze it back, and rotate back. Come on, squeeze, yes, uh -huh. We're gonna put combos one and two together, squat it out. Outer thigh, lift, now rotate back. Now rotate that hip, and squeeze. That's it, squat it out. Outer thigh, come on, squeeze. Press it back, now rotate. Nice job, come on, take it out. Outer thigh, lift, nice job, come on, press it back. We have one more, can we do it? Down, and lift, squeeze, take it back. Now rotate, all right, other side, we made it through, woo! Take that chair over. We're gonna do the same count. You're gonna give me a four count squat, ready, go. And in, that's it. Same form, you're sending it back on your heels. Abs are in tight. Nice job. Give me one more of those. That's it, now let's take it to tempo, singles. Take it down and up. Now the weight is distributed on both feet evenly. You're not grabbing onto the chair too hard. That's it, so you're straight down, straight up. Straight down, straight up, that's it. Excellent job, are we ready for the outer thigh? Ready, take it out. And up, squeeze, and in. Out, that's it, squeeze, and in. That's it, come on, press it down. And lift, nice job. Down, and lift. Come on, press it back, and squeeze, that's it. You're gonna do as many as you can. Bring both feet together, bend those knees, tuck your hips forward, relax the shoulders, straight back. That's it, now there's a slight bend in both knees so you're not locking out that joint. You're standing straight up. Come on, straight back. Excellent job, come on, press. And press, now rotate it, rotate it back. Come on, squeeze. Feel that contraction right through that bun, right through that hamstring. Come on, squeeze it back. And that's it, come on, and squeeze. And squeeze, combine both of them, take it back. Now rotate, yeah, you should be feeling these. Come on, take it back. All right, give me one more, press. Now squat it out, combine them. Down and up, lift, take it back. That's it, come on, and squeeze, nice job. Down and up, lift, take it back. Good job. Come on, keep it up. Down and up. Squeeze, rotate it back. Excellent job. Keep going, we have one more. 
Come on, take it down and up. Squeeze, rotate it back. Now rotate. Good job, hold it here. Good job for the first section. We're gonna set up for the second set. All right, abs are in tight. Slight bend your knee, in your knees. Tuck those hips, relax the shoulders. Singles back. Take it back and in, that's it. We did these in the beginning set, so they should be perfect with those toes facing forward. Slight bend in the knees. That's it, get that little extra contraction through the buns. Come on, squeeze. So you can, go through the, you can go through the range of motion, but I want you to concentrate and use that muscle. That's it, come on, give me two more. That's it, one more, pull those feet together. All right, take one foot back, take it a wide stance so that your knees are right in line with your heels. We're gonna take it singles down, lunge it down, and up. Now you should feel these through that back hip. <laughs> Right through that buttocks, down and up. Now make sure you are going straight down and straight up. You want to avoid going forward into the lunge. Down and up. Now if you are advanced, you can always take that hand off the chair and balance yourself or just gently place the hand on top. Good job. Give me two more. One more. And bring those feet together. We're going to put both of those together. We're going to take a buttock squeeze, one lunge, buttock squeeze, feet together. Ready, go. Out and down, lift and in. Out and down, lift and in. Now, got to make sure you're stepping it wide enough back so that your knees, again, remain in front and in back of the heel. Down, up. And release. Good job. Chest is up. You're breathing. Excellent job. Come on, push through the heel. Take it back. That's it. Good job. We have four more. Yeah. Are we feeling through those buns? That's it. Give me one more. Last one. And hold it here. Let's take it around to the other side. All right, same setup. Bend your knees. Tuck your hips under, relax your shoulders back. You're gonna do the same exercise, singles back. Take it back and in. Slight bend in both knees so you avoid ex hyperextending the knee joint. Squeeze it back and in. Toes are facing forward. Nice job. Last four, you can do it. Come on, press it back. Don't give it up now. That's it, two more. Give me one more. Bring those feet together. Woo! All right, take that leg all the way back. Again, wide enough stance. Chest is lifted. Tuck your hips forward. Singles down. Down and up. Excellent job. Come on. <laughs> Press through the heels of that foot. Come on, straight down, straight up. Again, you can take both hands on your hip. Take it straight down. Come on, down and lift. Down and up. Excellent. Come on, you have four more. We can do it. Four more. That's it. Come on. Two more. One more. And bring those feet together. We're going to put one and two together. You're going to give me a buttock squeeze, a lunge, then back together. Let's go. Out and down. Up and in. Out and down. Up and and in, that's it, come on, really step it back. I want you to use those legs. Don't make it a baby one, make it a big one. That's it, come on. <laughs> that's it, no cheating. We wanna see perfect form. That way we can see the definition in those buns. That's it, come on. Take it out. <laughs> come on, you got three more. Give me one more, come on, last one. And up, and down. Good job, guys, give yourselves a hand. We're gonna take it down to the floor. You can put your step away or your chair, get a towel or a mat, and some dumbbells, and we're gonna continue this great workout for our buns. Good job, guys, woo! All right, woo! Hey, we're 
continuing onto the floor, you're going to need a dumbbell either anywhere from two to five pounds, just enough to give you a little bit of resistance. You, you don't want to go too heavy. Now your knees are right in line with your hips, you're down on your elbows, you're looking right down at your thumbs. Okay, go ahead and grab your weight, place it behind your knee, and you want to grab it really hard so you don't lose it. We're going to lift that leg up, press both hips down into your mat so you don't have one hip higher than the other. Okay, so we're square to the floor, abs are nice and tight, relax your shoulders. Okay, you can flex that foot, just make it comfortable. We're going to take it down for two. Down and down and up and up. Good job. Slow and controlled, full range of motion. Last two. That's it, give me one more. Excellent job. Now hold it up there, now give me one inch up, one inch down. That's it. Now make sure your knee is facing towards the floor and set it out to the side. That's it. Come on, squeeze it tight. Nice job. Really concentrate on pressing that hip down. Give me one more. That's it. Now hold it up there and squeeze it tight. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Ah, slowly lower. Good job. Take that weight out. Place it at the top of your mat. That's it. Extend that leg out, your toes down on the floor. Now slowly lift that leg up. And again, making sure your hips are evenly placed to the floor. We're going to give me a hamstring curl for two. Ready? Pull it in for two. That's it. Now press it back out. You really have to squeeze that hamstring nice and tight. Pull it in. Excellent job. One more. Take it in. Now give it to me for singles. Come on and pull. That's it. Keep that knee lifted. I know when the leg gets a little tired, we have a tendency to drop it, but I want you to keep that contraction through the buttocks. That's it. Come on, give me three more. One more. Now hold it there. Hold it there. Okay. We're going to do a little hip rotation. You're going to take the knee out for two to the side, and then you're going to pull it back in. Ready? Take it out for two and then in. Now this is a really tiny motion. It's not very big if you're doing it correctly. So those hips are pressed down and you should feel this. That's it, last one. Now take it to singles and press it out and in. That's it, again, you have to keep that knee lifted. Come on, squeeze it tight. Excellent job, come on, press it out. You should feel these working. That's it, give me one more. Now hold it there, hold it. Slowly lower, stretch it back, nice stretch, excellent job, take it back up. We're going to go to the other side. All right, take that weight right behind your knee, lift that leg up, press the hips down evenly, take it down for two. Down and down, up and up, that's it. Now as you grab that weight, you should be squeezing that hamstring, that's going to give you a little more extra contraction. You should feel like, give me one more. That's it. Now hold it up there. Give me one inch up. Take it up, one inch down. So it's real tiny, really tiny. So you really can feel that contraction. Sometimes the smaller they are, they hurt worse. <laughs> That's it. Come on, squeeze it up. That's it. You're going to give me one more. Now hold it up there. Hold it, hold it, hold it. And slowly lower. Nice job. Okay, take that weight out. Extend that leg out. Lift it up. Press those hips down, pull it in for two. Let's go. In and in. That's it. Come on, squeeze it tight. Think about what you're doing. That's it. <laughs> Abs are in nice and tight. That's it. Give me one more. Come on, take it in. Excellent job. Give me singles. Take it in. Press it out. That's it. Now you have to add a little bit of resistance on your own. Just don't fling that leg. Make it work. Squeeze. Nice job. That's it, give me two more. That's it, now one more, hold it there, hold it there. We're gonna give me that rotation. Two out, ready? Two out, let's go. Out and out, press it in. Remember, those hips have to be pressed down. Okay, so you gotta think about your form. Instead of lifting that hip up, you're kinda pressing it down. Last one, that's it. Let's take it to singles. Press it out and in. And in. These should feel really good. <laughs> That's it. Come on. Squeeze it out. Excellent job. All the way out. Really tiny. Come on. One more. Hold it there. Hold it there. And slowly lower. Push into it. Stretch it out. Nice job. You guys ready for the next set of exercises? Okay, 
we're gonna go to our next position. Take it all the way down, head is rested. Take your legs at a 45 degree angle. Make sure your hips are stacked over one on top of another instead of leaning backwards or too far forward. We're gonna grab our weight. You're gonna take it right on top of that hip. Relax the head, pull those abs in nice and tight. We're gonna lift it up for a count of two. So we're gonna take it up and up, down and down. That's it, squeeze the buttocks as you lift. That's it, come on, take it up. Good job, give me one more. Take it up. Now take it for single, slow and controlled. Even on the way down, work that negative phase. That's it, the whole leg moves as one unit. So your heel's right in line with your knee. Abdominals are in tight, that's it. All right, now hold it up there. We're gonna rotate that hip. So we're gonna lift the knee up for two and then down for two. So we're gonna take it up for two and down, that's it. This is a really concentrated exercise geared toward the top of that buttocks. That's it, come on, squeeze it tight, give me one more. That's it, take it to single. So really rotate it up and down, nice job. Abs are in tight, so you're gonna protect that lower back. That's it, come on, squeeze. How's this one feeling? That's it, up. Now hold it there, hold it, hold it, hold it, squeeze it tight. That's it, you're gonna slowly lower that knee down to the floor. Down, press out, lift and lower. Down and up, lift and lower, nice job. Excellent, that's it, come on. Take it down and lift, squeeze and lower, nice job. Come on, press through full range of motion, that's it, down, squeeze. That's it, come on, down and up. Give me one more. Take it down, lift, now hold it there, and slowly lower, good job. Place the weight down on the floor, lift yourself up, and pull both that knee in. That's it, sit up real tall, good job. We're gonna take it over to the other side. All right, lay it all the way down, make sure you have your weight nearby. All right, legs at a 45 degree angle, tuck your hips under, abs are in tight. Place that weight gently on top of the thigh. Lift it up for two, let's go. Take it up and up and down and down. That's it, come on, still lifting it as a full unit. That's it, come on, squeeze and lift. Down and down, give me one more. That's it, take it to singles. Lift it up and down, excellent job. Now you really wanna watch that knee alignment. Those knees should be right in line with each other. That's it, come on, squeeze and lower. Excellent job. Come on, think about it. Use those muscles, hold it. Rotate up for two. Up and up and down and down. Nice job. This is the killer one, I know. This one actually does all that work. Puts all that work into it. Give me one more. Nice job, take it for singles. Let's go, take it up. Excellent, come on, rotate it. Keep that hip in one spot, that rotation, you're lifting that knee. Excellent job, come on, squeeze. Nice, come on, lift, give me one more, hold it. Knee drops down, slowly press it out and lift. Excellent, come on, down, press it out and lift. Nice, down, squeeze it and lift. Slow and controlled, that's it, come on. Yeah, this one really works. You really get in that meat of that, that muscle. <laughs> down and up, that's it. Come on, down, lift. Give me one more, and down, lift it up, hold it, and slowly lower, good job. Drop that weight, sit yourself up, pull that knee in, get a nice stretch, drop that hip down. You should feel a nice stretch to that buttocks. Good job, okay, cross the feet, we're gonna cool it down, place both hips down, take a big inhale up. You guys did a great job through the whole entire workout. I'm really impressed, again, take it up. Okay, we're gonna start our stretches. You're gonna take your right foot in front, place the left one right at the ankle. Take the hands in front, now pull those shoulder blades back. You're nice and tall, abs are in. Take a big inhale in, exhale out. Just let that muscle relax into the stretch. We did a lot of work with our hamstrings. And again, inhale in, and exhale. Good job, pull the knee in, 
And we're gonna slowly rotate back. I want you to look over that shoulder. Sitting up real tall, avoid locking out the elbow. That's it. And take it back to the front. We're gonna take the left leg over the right leg. Take the hands behind. Now gently pull that heel in on the right and then pull that foot back. It's gonna increase that stretch a little bit. This should feel really good for that buttocks. That's it, just hold it. Excellent job. Now release it. Take that left leg in front. The right heel comes out. Take the hands in front. Pull the shoulder blades back. That's it. Now take a big inhale in and exhale out. You should feel that stretch to the left hamstring. And again, inhale and exhale. Great job. Pull that knee in. Just rotate back. Look over that shoulder. Again, stretching out that back. Hold it. Let everything relax. Take it back to the middle. Cross your right leg over the left. Take the hands behind. Gently slide the heel in. Now pull that toe back. Good job. Just hold it. If you need to increase the stretch, pull the heel in a little closer. And if you can't pull it in too close, just slide it out a little bit. Excellent job. Okay, cross both feet over. I'm just going to take a big inhale in and exhale out. Nice job again. Inhale in and exhale out. Drop the right arm and lift up with the left, lifting up and out of that rib cage right next to your ear. Nice stretch. Take it up and over. Take it over to the other side. Keep both hips on the floor. That's it. Come on, really stretch it up and release it. I want you to drop the ear down, relax. That's it, take it back to the middle. Stretch it over to the left. Nice job. Take it back to the middle. Great job, guys. I want you to continue working out with a brand new butt and I guarantee you're gonna get the results that you want. Nice job. Take a big inhale up and exhale down.